Hey guys, so I've literally just arrived at the gate. I'm waiting to board and I've got myself my latte. I always get a soy hazelnut latte, which is like my favorite. But yeah, I have a feeling that I'm super early because there's literally nobody here. So yeah, I'm just gonna sit down here. But you guys are wondering like, what the hell's going on. So I changed up my hair, I got myself a fringe. I've always wanted a fringe, I had a fringe before. This is actually before I started YouTube and I kind of missed it. So I wanted to go for something quite short and cropped, but you guys should let me know what you think. I feel like I look really different. I also picked up some breakfast stuff. So I'm having scrambled eggs. I usually get this from Starbucks a lot. How good does that look? It's so healthy as well. I don't know how my name is Hazia, but I guess that's my new name now. It's not Kezia, is it? It's too This will be actually my first time in the US. I haven't been to America before and I'm so excited that I get the opportunity to go to LA because I've been wanting to go to LA. Although this trip's going to be quite short, I think it's going to be a teaser and a taster for me because I am planning on coming back again this year for a longer period of time. So yeah, if you guys can leave comments or like suggestions of places to eat down below and I think it would actually be nice to have like a get together, like a mini meet up if anybody's in LA but I'll try and organize that for the next trip because this time I wouldn't but basically we're off with Universal and there's a new movie called Breaking In featuring Gabrielle Union and yeah, it's a horror thriller so we're just gonna go and experience the whole movie but also I get the opportunity to interview Gabrielle Union I absolutely love her from all the way back to bring it on days so I'm really really excited to yeah just experience everything So guys, after such a long flight, I finally arrived. We're staying at the Ace Hotel. Guys, check this out. So, let me show you around MTV Cribs. So, anyone who knows me knows how much I love marble. I've got my phone and key here, ignore that. So this is so cool. And so we also have over here the shower. So yeah, it's pretty cool. It's really cute, really cozy, and also very quirky. So we yeah. are. Look at my views. Okay. So basically, this is my airport outfit, and I wanted to dress quite brightly for the trip because I was like, I'm coming to LA, and I want to dress bright. Everyone's wearing black, so I was like, oh my god, that's usually me. So over here is the mini bar. Now, guys, so don't hate me for this, but basically, we get access to the mini bar. It's all covered, so let's go through this. I'm gonna do like a mini snack haul for you guys, where I'm just gonna basically open up all these things and try them. Oh my God, got to love Haribo's. Also got some wine. I freaking love wine. I'm so excited. I've got American candy here. Anyway, this is a big shocker. I've been here for like how long? There is an actual mini bar. Now let's see what we can have. So this is the coolest thing I've ever seen. They actually keep their water in a box. So yeah, this is boxed water. I'm gonna drink that. And so I'm gonna help myself to some root beer. So this is root beer. I tried some of Amber's, tasted really good, so I'm gonna have that. What else is there? So this is club, I don't know what that is. So there's gin and tonic, I'm gonna have that. And what else is there? Oh, what is this? This reminds me of like Fanta, Mandarin. So you guys, that's basically a mini room tour of my hotel room, really room tour. I can't believe my makeup has stayed like for the duration of like 
12 13 hours it is currently 11 30 in the night in london and here it's like two three o'clock so the fact that i'm not jet lag hasn't hit me yet i'm just about powering through so yeah what we're going to do now is we're basically going to pop downstairs and we're going to go to cvs or one of the stores close by to pick up some snacks because we're going to see the screening of breaking in tonight which i'm so excited about because tomorrow we're going to interview gabriel union <laughs> so yeah so basically gonna just freshen up a bit and yeah just head downstairs and pick up some snacks come back to the hotel get ready for tonight because after the screen i'm gonna go for dinner and do something quite nice so yeah i think by now when i'm done i need to like basically go back down because everyone will be waiting for me everything ready on hand this is basically my makeup bag i've got my makeup in there i also bought a beauty blender just so i can quickly do my makeup because I find this so easy to use. I'm using Simple and I'm using the Hydrating Gel Cream and I'm also using the Hydrating Booster and I've got, I've got my trusty Simple Wipes. So basically I have cleansed my skin by using the Simple Range, I brought that along with me and now I'm just going to moisturise with my cream. But actually before that I think I'm going to use the Hydrating Booster. I kind of like the way this feels on my skin. So nice. Oh god. So I'm gonna do my makeup now. I'm literally behind schedule. Um because now we're just getting ready to go to the um screening. So I'm really excited. I've still got my fringe. Um yeah, so Ooh. Guys, we're literally just off to the screening. We're breaking in. Say hi, Eva. Oh, say hi. hi. <laughs> so literally, yes, we're heading off. And yeah, so oh my god, is that traffic? Yeah, this is LA traffic. So experiencing LA traffic for the first time. I really don't know what to expect, but yeah, we're off to the screening, and yeah, it's really beautiful, really pretty. Oh, look at LA. Morning guys, so literally it is day two of our trip and today um, we're just going to tour a bit of LA but it's also the day we get to interview the cast from Breaking In which I'm so excited about. I'm also a bit nervous. I'm so sorry I could not even do like a 
a proper review yesterday because I was so tired. So just a bit of a background on the movie. The movie is basically about a woman who goes back to her old family home. They get a break in from armed robbers. Now the movie is basically them trying to survive and try to come out alive and it's very action packed. So yeah, it was really good. Um, nice seeing Gabrielle Union in a different light. Um, I'm playing a bit more of a challenging role and I do believe she co-produced the movie as well so yeah it was good the food so far guys is amazing I ordered room service last night I ordered some steak but it was so funny I was falling asleep and I heard a knock on the door and then I remembered that I'd ordered food and I had to sit down there like I was sleepy I was hungry the jet lag was getting to me but yeah so far so good I have already had like a shower cleanse my face <laughs> This is where I could tell like when LA or we're using LA water, like my skin is being so good to me. So yeah, that's that. I've also got one more lash, like literally hanging on. But yeah, that's that. I should order room service. I'm waiting for my breakfast. I ordered avocado and toast and a green juice. I'm trying to be a bit healthy. But do you know what it is? It's not even on purpose that I'm trying to eat healthy. I just have not really been craving like heavy food. I've just been craving like salads and you know pasta of course um but like yeah i didn't really feel like having like a proper english breakfast or a proper breakfast with, like grilled um sausages bacon and everything i'm saving all of that sort of stuff for lunch time because we're going to try and head out and tour the town hey guys so literally just getting ready to head upstairs we're going to go to the bar grab a few drinks and take photos before we head off to our interview i think i might have a quick outfit change just because i want to dress a bit smartly for the interview and i notice my dress is a bit too i don't know just not as appropriate as i would have hoped so yes LA lights are looking really good. I think I've showed you guys the view already. It's so pretty. So, so pretty. And that's downstairs. And yeah, let me show you guys my outfit. So, this is my dress. Public Desire shoes. And I got these sunnies from Forever 21. They're really cute. They're six pounds. And yeah, they're like cat eyes. Let's see. Anybody who knows me, I usually keep them up like this, as if I'm actually wearing it. <laughs> the story behind my fringe is I did want to get a fringe. I wanted to get it for a while now, just so I can grow my brows out and also grow my hair. Because the front part of my hair is broken because I dye it, I relax it, I do a lot of things. So I kind of wanted it to rest. Now, if you do want to get a fringe, I'd probably say this is a wig. This is from Diva's Wigs and I got the wig a while back. I absolutely love it because it fits really well, quite snug. So Diva's Wigs, I'm going to leave a link in the description bar below for you guys to check it out. And yeah, I just ordered the fringe and I took it to a hairdresser, Angel's Hair and Beauty, and I got them to cut it to kind of cut how I wanted it. So yeah, if you are thinking of getting a fringe, in particular a really easy way is just to buy a wig and then just get them to customize it but i would recommend going to somebody you know or you trust or a specialist who knows how to cut hair because as you know when the wig is cut there's no growing back literally no going no growing it's not happening so and if you're going to spend your hard-earned money not only to buy the wig but also to cut and style it you want to make sure that the person doesn't make um a mess of it so yeah that's for you guys asking me because i post Hey guys, it's day two and I'm here with Amber. Say hi. Hey guys. <laughs> so we're basically taking in the beautiful scenery before we head off to do our interviews. It's so, so, so beautiful. So basically one of the things I love about this hotel is the deco. It's like boho chic and a bit like retro hipster. It's like a hipster vibe. And look, so it's quite quiet because it's really early in the morning. Um, but yeah, so. Today I'm wearing like my favourite Topshop dress. I take photos as well. Oh my god! So yeah, I'm really excited and so far LA is so fun and so beautiful. So looking forward to what's happening today. And I do apologise if I am whispering into the camera. I've just wrapped up the interview with 
It's Jana and Gabrielle and it was amazing. They were so lovely. Now what we're gonna do is, funny enough, jet lag hasn't hit Hello. me. Hi. Because technically in London right now it's 12 midnight, so, but we are fine. So we're gonna go down, get changed, and we're gonna head out again. <laughs> So this is Modelo and it is a golden flavoured lager so basically I'm having pims, a special kind of beer pims and add a bit of beer. Oh, how good does that look? What are you having? Eman's having ginger beer. It looks like quite lethal. That looks lethal. Yeah. That looks pretty cool. I can't go wrong with fries. So good. So guys, I got a really, oh it's quite hot, but I got a really juicy pork chop on a bed of greens, got some roasted garlic and a bit of mustard sauce. I'm so excited. And also our last day in LA, it's been so fun. Like, interviewed at Gabrielle Union and Asiana yesterday for the movie Breaking In. Basically, we just decided to chill, so we went for dinner and came upstairs to my room. I basically was like, oh, went on my phone. I was like, okay, I'm gonna have a nap. And then I woke up at like 1 a.m. So yeah, yesterday's plans, we planned a tour in like, Hollywood, but I was so tired. I feel like the jet lag literally hit me. So today before our flight, which is in the late afternoon, um, we're gonna try and see the Hollywood sign. We're basically gonna be like tourists today. And yeah, so that's basically our plans. And then we come back to the hotel and then we check out and then we're off to get our flight back to London. Hey guys, this is my breakfast. I'm having some bread, some scrambled eggs, some potatoes, bacon and sausage. And I also got myself a glass of freshly squeezed grapefruit juice. And yeah, this is my current view, so pretty. So yeah, this is it. I'm curious to try the scrambled egg. Mmm. And I've got my Coca-Cola bottle. <laughs> what do you guys think? Fashionable enough? Uh huh. <laughs> I'm so silly. But yeah. Do -do. I feel like there's some jewelry missing. So. So, guys, this is my last like outfit change. I'm going to change before we go to the airport. I'm going to wear jeans on top because I don't think this would be appropriate to travel in. I've got my trainers. Just waiting for a new bar. Just like checked out as well. I'm so sad to be leaving. So we're just gonna wait for the Uber. It will be here any minute now and then we're gonna head on. Do, do, do. do you know what's so funny? I was taking loads of photos again in the room. <laughs> yeah. Just to kill time. And so yeah, I am back in London. LA was amazing and I'd love to thank Universal for this opportunity. Meeting Gabrielle and Asiana was probably one of the, obviously the highlights of the trip. So yeah, that was that. It was such an amazing trip and I really enjoyed it and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm gonna go back to my cooking videos. You guys probably think, Kezia, where are all the recipe videos? I'm gonna go back to that, but I'm gonna do a bit more vlogs and I'm gonna try and get into the swing of things. I kind of enjoy vlogging, you know? And I'm doing a lot more trips this year, like short breaks here and there, um, which I'm gonna be booking with my friends. So yeah, guys, 
if you want to see more vlogs don't forget to thumbs up also suggestions my next vlog is actually going to be my sort of hair and skin prep so how i prep before my trip to la because a lot of you were asking about my skin because my skin was glowy and dewy and it's because i had a treatment done at a clinic which i'm going to be talking about which is easily accessible it's nothing major but it's just a deep cleanse treatment and um, an exfoliating treatment so i'm going to do that along with kind of like my hair prep so yeah guys if you want to see that don't forget to subscribe thumbs up this video and i'll see you all very soon bye